So today I start my walking tour in Portimo, although I normally just call this Pride of Russia area. Uh, down here on the beach, if you don't mind a few steps, little restaurant bar place. I saw this on another video, thought, oh, I'd like to find this. So this is just from the car park. If you ask for a restaurant Beatriz, put that into Uber, because I've been Ubering everywhere. Uber is so cheap in Portugal. It's great. Uh, you don't have to look for taxis, you don't have to look for taxi rank. You just open the Uber app and uh, you're off to your destination. So this is the restaurant bar. I think it's just a bar. We'll go down in a second. Uh, so Uber. Yes, I was saying about Uber. It is relatively cheap. It cost me like four euros to get from my hotel to here. The same was about seven euros in a taxi. We've been over to Albufeira, Lagosh, and again, all uh, really good prices. So this is the beach there, unfortunately. Uh, I'm on my last couple of days and the clouds have come over quite thick in Alvor today and Portugal in general, which is a shame, really. Let's take a walk down here. Got some locals coming up from the beach. I'm not sure if this bar is going to be open. I could do with a drink, you know. Let's have a look. Down we go. I'm going to come back up these steps in a minute. I don't see if anybody sat outside. It'd be a shame if he's closed. Bar Amado is called. And. Oh no, he is open. We'll take a walk down the beach first of all. As you can see, seaweed. Um, last few years on beaches, we did Mexico, Cape Verde, Dominican. They all seem to have a really bad seaweed problem. Not sure why. Okay, I'm going to head back up the stairs. We'll get a drink in a little minute. Okay, so after coming back up those stairs, which nearly killed me, we're now into car park area heading down towards the main shopping centre itself. So all the dunes to the right. It used to be a walking trail. You still can walk here, but it's a little bit difficult. It's also a main road, this, as you can see. So it's best to walk to the side. It's not too bad when you've got a petrol power, it's them electric buggers that sneak up on you. Some nice scenic shots from here. See you down to the beach area. Some more stairs down to the beach. But I'm not going down them. No. There's another beach hut there, sells drinks, I'm guessing. 
Just down these stairs here. Let's carry on up here. We'll get us this pagoda on the right and then we'll take a break. Hotels there, lots of hotels. Okay, I think it's time to sit down here. Let's take me a few minutes and enjoy the sea air. Okay, so let's push on from here. Now I've had my five minute rest. A lot of hotels, some uh, got some nice sea views, I guess. Carry on down the boardwalk area here. Jardin de Rocha. See, as I said, I always thought this was called Pride de Rocha, but it's actually classed as Portimo. Looks like the clouds may be starting to clear. It might be a warm afternoon in uh, on the Algarve today. <laughs> some looks at the sea area on the beach I just realized I've walked on this stone I've got one in my shoe bear with me a second okay now I've got the stone out of my crocs yes I wear crocs don't like crocs well that's your choice do you like crocs when I'm on holiday lounging around the house in they're comfortable and deadpool likes them so that will give it some credibility surely what's that the setting up for a market day Cute little doggy. More stairs. If you've ever been to Albuquerque, they've got an escalator down to their beach. That's what's needed around here. Not too bad going downstairs, but coming up, whew, it can be a killer. There we go. Takes you down to is that Blanguino? Salads, burgers, cocktails, fish. Everywhere you go, it's fish. Okay, we've got an Italian restaurant. Oh, yeah, it looks like it's closed down. I am now at the back end of September, so it may be closed for the season. People turn it into a cool rest area. We have a Casa de Rocha restaurant there. Now coming down to the main part. And this hotel's got a good view. Came in Pride de Rocha. Well, this area for a drink last night. Drink prices are so expensive in comparison to Alvor. Here we are. Umberto's tapas. More restaurants. Some building work going on there. Get on this side. Nakio.
What else have we got? Valeria. Oh, Amazon like Power Walk today. See a lot of these CBD shops as well popping up in Elvore just recently. A whole lot more ATMs as well. ATMs used to be sort of few and far between, but seems to be a lot more of them now. Taffy's Bar and Grill. And the snack bar on the beach there. Let's have a wander over here. There's a market on this morning. Chef House, Steakhouse. Excuse my pronunciations. Place right on the beach there. And a Deficio Concord. That's a very tall high rise. Let's do a quick spin around the market, see what's on offer. Start down the back here, work our way back to the front. Hats and beach towels. Oh, oh there's just another back there, apart from that, come through here. Jewelry. More hats, more beach towels. Seems to be a theme. Handbags. You can get the same ones from the uh, lucky, lucky guy. And again, just clothes over there. I'm not going to walk over there and bore you with that footage. Shops here again, beach towels, umbrellas, blow up toys. Carousel, not in use at the moment. What else have we got? A handicrafts, Dewdrop, Bistro. The other thing as well, gelato, seems to be a really big thing in Portugal. Seems to be like a massive rise of gelatos, ice cream bars. The weather being as warm as it is, it's, uh, it's well needed. There's a spa, you recognise that if you're from England. There's an all you can eat restaurant there. I think it's a Chinese, I think. And spa. Actually, you know what? I'm going to nip into spa and get myself a bottle of water. I could do with a bit of a rehydrate. It's been a bit of a long walk.
Right, so I think I may have lost audio. I'm using a clip on mic. If I have, I'll just fill those little bits with some music while I wander around. Okay, we're at the Hotel de Russia. Heading uptown now. My son's gone behind the clouds again, so I can carry on walking. I've probably got about another couple of thousand feet to go before I reach the very end of this walk. If you watch this far, thanks for watching. Stay on the pavement, it's a very busy road. Bamboo garden, pharmacy, another ATM. There's no real bars and stuff down here. I just thought I'd take you for a walk down. Another ice cream place. I told you, big ice cream places. That's the bin wagon when I just cross this road. Bin wagon stink. Tattoo club. Ooh, nice. Oh, it's got run down then. This is the uh, casino. On guard casino. Little snack bar here. I got a small beer and a rum and coke from here, and it was 12 euros. Seems to have a thing where they don't fill it with a mix now, they give you a small can of coke or whatever your mixer you want. So you end up have to buy another drink to use the mixer or just use the mixer up. Electric scooters, another thing that's big. You can hire them out if you want to while you're here. Hotel Santa Caterina. We've got a pizzeria, a Dolce Vita. Of course, plenty of places where you can hire boat trips for the day. Find these across most of the Algarve. Place to go scuba diving there if you want to. A very lonely and boring job that. Just standing in one of those all day. The Algarve Moor. Sikandar Russia, Tandoori Indian cuisine. Very nice, I do like a bit of Tandoori. There we go. Got the boats or jet skis out. I was going to go jet skiing this year, just never found the time. Oriental Hotel. Or traffic. Well, 
much further to go now until I reach the very end of this wall. The, the wall, I mean, down there. Is the clouds keeping the sun off me today? Mandala restaurant there. Surf shop. Smoothies, that's another thing as well that's got quite popular recently. Smoothies. how far I've walked all the way from down there at least one person gives me a thumbs up the video but it was worth doing if you stayed with me this long congratulations you win yourself a smiley face and love heart if you leave a comment the little bar area there down to the beach here, let's cross over. More hotels. That's the first time I've ever been this far up here. I did actually walk out on that jetty over in the background there for an afternoon watching the fishermen. Villa Lido. That's a nice motorbike. do have some gorgeous beaches on the Algarve okay almost at the end of the walk this is pretty take a look in here some nice little seat areas in the shade as well it's time for a quick break okay after another brief rest there because I'm old because I need to rest so I'll quick look around this area here nice little rest area sadly though it looks like it's seen better days This is the view of the beach area, the boardwalk. I do like the fact they've got the restaurants and the bars just on the beach there. Just a shame the sea is so far, you've got a bit of a trek from the bar down to the sea edge. So I prefer uh, Alvor, Three Brothers. It's a lot closer to the sea where the bars and restaurants and stuff are. Right, let's complete this then. We'll walk around here. Oop. I think this is the old castle wall. Let's walk over this side first. What have we got here? Some pretty coloured buildings. There's a pizza hut down there, I think, once upon a time when I came in 2007. Pretty sure there was. And you got the harbour. Oh, NH Hotels and Resorts. Nice place to stay in, I guess. 
the other side there is Ferraguda. You can get a water taxi across and explore that side. Or you can take a travel in a taxi or again in an Uber. Let's have a walk through here then. See what's on this side. That's rather cool. Hmm. Got a step here. Oh, nice and cool in here. Toilet for ladies and for gents behind me. <laughs> That's a novel sign. How many times you found yourself like that? Quite a few times. As you get older, the plumbing doesn't quite work. old cannon well they've got the inflatables up so that's it that's the tour down Pride of Russia Beach through Portimo I have done a Portimo video if you want to check that out I'll leave a link in the description if I remember Otherwise, that's it. Thanks for watching.